Hello there everyone and welcome back to more Blood Bowl action. We have just four matches left in the season. We are getting very close to the breaking point of either making it to the playoffs or not. As only the top eight are going to be able to proceed from here on out. And we're currently tied with Chaos, which I unfortunately didn't get a chance to play against Xanax. It had to be a substitute. So it's, if, yeah, and I had to unfortunately lose that match, at least in the substitute game. But... Our other adversary that we're about to face off, the Chaos Dwarves, are going to be another matter entirely. It goes without saying, I had a rough time against Swen and his Dwarves, but a lot of that was due to the fact of early Dwarves, was it not Dwarves, but early, early Ogre removals, which basically gave me almost nothing to do as far as bullying and punching them. Now that I have a full roster, that can be alleviated, although it does beg the question, is it worth me chancing? Having a handful of my ogres on the front line for the hope of at least preserving my Noblar. Because we only have a single gar a claw might blow piece to worry about, but it is still a claw might blow piece. It might not have been as terrifying if it was one skill or the other. And we have three other might, well actually four other might blow pieces to contend with. One of which of course being the Minotaur. That can, I can abuse that relatively well, but I don't think it's worth the risk. With the amount of muscle on the field, especially for Strength 5 Bull Centaur, which hopefully you may have noticed. Although, with that said, there is an odd decision here with having Strip Ball on a Bull Centaur. This would make a lot more sense if Forklift, their Strength 5 Bull Centaur, were to get another level up in. If I'm completely honest, because Break Tackle synergizes so nicely with the Cage Breaking and getting onto a Ball Carrier. But regardless... We have our work cut out for us. It's not going to be pretty. And they also have a block Minotaur, but that's just putting us on even footing. And I do have better armor than said Minotaur. And as a result, it may be the first one I'll try and get rid of. Especially since we both have the same team value here. Which means I don't have to worry about wizards or star players. But it's still only six ogres that really I have going for me here. Hopefully, their skill set is going to be enough for at least tying this game. Winning might be difficult unless I get some early injuries, because again, they're at the point where they only have three hobgoblins, and maybe a minotaur is kind of the easiest ones I can take out. There's only one way, there's only one way really to know though, so let us dive on in head first and hope we don't forget what we're supposed to do. Let the slaughter and bloodfest commence. I'm hoping I'll be able to level the two chorfs that are have been sitting at like one injury away for the past four games. Uh, they're just there to taunt you. Saying you could have gave him the ball for a guaranteed 3 SPP, but you didn't. Instead, you gave it to the bull centaur, which is pretty much the smart choice, but you, you still could have gave it to the blockers. Unfortunately, I actually can't even give it to the blockers. They're so damn slow. <laughs> that hasn't stopped my ogres. <laughs> Damn, I fail to see me. the problem. And my guys are prone to just standing there for a turn or two. The only benefit, of course, ogres have over your dwarves is it's not exactly easy to get a white die on them, let alone two. Ah, and for like the sixth match in a row, I lose the coin flip. <laughs> Do you have a nobbler named Propane by any chance? No, not yet. I like to I like to come up with terms that it, it describes their utterly demise, pretty much. As opposed to them actually being useful. The exception of course would That's be. That's why you gotta name him Propane. Hmm, <laughs> propane. Just, well if I'll consider it if I want to do puns like Everyone else so far. I'll consider it. With L, what is it? Malt and his uh, LV puns. What is oh it? What God, puns Malt. did we have? Yeah, what did? Oh, godlike Malt. puns with his Norse too. And I'm trying to remember who. I'm pretty certain we had a, another team with puns in the last few seasons. I can't remember what they were. 
We've had a pun team a few times. Alright, let's see All right, how this goes. Backhoe, get in there. You you almost died game one, and now you may finally level. Good luck. You might need it. All right, well, let's see how badly this goes. Let's see if I get blitzed once again. <laughs> Fucking Scythe rolling two blitzes in a row on me and one turn touchdown fine, fine. on me. Gotta, gotta get to a nerve or two. I hate this game so much. Not another blitz. At least it's not as bad with those ogres. Yeah. Will they just bonehead is the ultimate question. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a one in six that the blitz doesn't even work. Indeed. Well, that's the first hurdle dealt with. What about the second? Dump truck thought he was going to level. He actually just dies. Hmm, I'm not against that. But he'll live for now. So, how many ogres are going to cooperate? Pretty good so far. But that can always change on a dime. Hard yes, lessons you learn playing ogres. <laughs> oh, I already know, because I lost two games because of back-to-back -back boneheads primarily. Not necessarily snake eyes, but considering it's almost always a good idea to touch down on like turn 7 instead of the final turn, it felt like snake eyes. And now you, you're free to punch some Nobler if you wish. Oh, I do. <laughs> who, who doesn't? If only there was a rule that allows me to punch them, but alas, I'm not vampires. Well, isn't, um... Isn't throw teammate basically punching them? Yeah, but I can only do that once a turn, as opposed to rolling poorly. Yeah, no. push. There you go. Starting off strong, but not an injury, alas. <laughs> Anything to get an ogre off the pitch. <laughs> There's still five more to get through. Yeah, I know. <laughs> So if if he follows, the block becomes it, much worse, but it's a it's nobler, a so it doesn't really matter. It's just a two die, and you got blocked, so who cares? But he's alive somehow, after yeah. nearly, <laughs> nearly somehow. being trampled on. Good strong start there. Forklift, the only reliable player on this team. I say that, but last game he managed to double one his GFI and then put the ball into a fucking war dancer's hands. So it was not ideal.
There's a bonehead to start off. At least it wasn't the, the most valuable ogres. This, like, middle of the pitch is going to get so ugly so fast. We'll see what happens. There. Nice knockdown. And, yes, break tackle, please. <laughs> the fucking dodge break tackle ogre. He's too scary. <laughs> <laughs> And somehow, that's a line that has no tackle on it. <laughs> yep, that's why I blitzed them. I had it all figured out. It's, of course, Bonehead's always the wild card to ruin things. No matter how well you may have things figured out, the ogres might not have things figured out. <laughs> they always have other plans, don't they, the sneaky little bastards? Such is always the, the problem. Indeed. No, leave him, ooh, leave him next to the Minotaur. <laughs> now, unless you want to blitz with him, basically it's 50-50, uh, he actually cooperates. You must compact the ogres as a, god damn it. They didn't want to burn our reroll there. They're going fast. No. Not against one who actually has block. Plus, I might need the reroll in case something stupid happens. There you go. Speaking of something stupid happening. Okay, red dice or get the one die. Or, well, it is one. Yeah, it's a red dice there at the moment with the guard. There's a one dice for ya. Don't even need the brick tackle. Okay, we are not moving anymore. You don't have any frenzy pieces. <laughs> And now for uh, the silly and the dangerous. Living on the edge. Wait a minute. I None of these are. No, there's the one die. Yep. There you go. Got knocked down for your trouble.
Lots of pushes this far. Now I can push you back. Man, I'd love to see an ogre with frenzy. Unfortunately, that is a doubles. That is reserved for more important skills, alas. I wish the ogres for like the ogre team had one more skill access, even if it was passing. <laughs> <laughs> one more, huh? Just to do ridiculous bullshit. Yeah, I mean, like, the strength skills are good, but what if you wanted to pick up accurate? <laughs> and we're both got blocks, so let's, let's just play our dance. Good job, Libar LTM 1120-9.1. You're, you're fighting off three ogres at once. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's the butt of every joke with a ridiculous name like that. Here he comes, ready or not. Oh my god, doesn't even need to use the brake tackle or the dodge like a fucking god. He's a beast. Now, if only we could somehow get him blocked too. And it's done for good measure. Alright, let's see where this ball... Oh my god. Oh, oh I was gonna I was saying, let's see where this ball bounces, but it's right into an ogre's hands. Hmm. Niffle smiles on this one ogre. Who's an abomination right. enough how, as is. Comes in. Fucking <laughs> nails the dodge. Knocks down my best player and grabs the ball. What a fucking monster. And thankfully I have rerolls. I have too many rerolls even. There's no such thing. Yeah, that's a fair point. Overs. No, put him next to the claw guy. Oh, don't worry. Your claw guy is going to come meet him soon, I'm sure. You can't resist the co urge corn is infused in, in that player. Yay, for Back not having my blow. <laughs> Poor guy. We believe in you. No, we don't. Not even for yeah. a moment. Ooh, but he's so close to a level up. I would love to see that. Because big guys I rarely know. get two level ups as is. Especially when you're not relying on... You're not blitzing with them. Yeah, like... And Bagger got fucking block on his first one. I've never gotten block on a big guy. <laughs> yeah, what would you get if you were to get a nerd devil? Because, of course, tackles, appealing, Bob. dodge... Claw. Oh yeah. Claw. Well, he... Chaos minnows oh. can't take it on a normal. You need a double. Okay. Or, or chork yeah. minnows, I mean. I was gonna say yes, I already got on normals, but that's that's a beast way to happen. You think my dodge to break tackle piece is scary? Wait till he gets that tri trinity. Uh, God, I wish I had, like, one hobgoblin that I could move around right now. No, he's next to the ball carrier. Let's see. 
four dwarves versus three ogres. This seems like a fair fight, right? Especially when more or less. When you get, yep, especially when you get the knockdowns like that. Although sadly, I, okay, you can. Oh, you can't get a one die there because you wouldn't block the assist. Oh no, never mind. The one that's next to two ogres has guard, so you can't get the one die. Okay, so and I, but I think instead I'm going to like set up a situation as good as I can here, and then go for some dumb shit. <sighs> oh, dumb shit is always fun, right? Indeed. Who can say no to that? Got a nice pal for your troubles. And somehow he's breathing. Thankfully, Claus right, doesn't the, affect him. The Nobblers are, are holding up surprisingly well this game. Yeah. It's only against Swen's match they were dropping like flies. And that was also the match where an ogre got injured on turn two. Or turn one and then knock out on turn three or four afterwards. So I was down to three ogres because one was missed next game. So I couldn't do anything. A bad combination. Those games are the fucking worst. Yep. Maybe if I still had like five ogres, I maybe four I could do something, but there you go. <laughs> Get in there, hard hat. Yeah, all I have to do is dodge out and pick up the ball again. Easy. This ogre, he can't be stopped. He does have dodge, or well, break tackle anyway in this case. He's got both, it's even worse. Yeah, there's something more shameful that may- uh, no, no. <laughs> Hilariously, I have a tackle piece on your ogre, which matters. <laughs> Maybe not as much as it seems, we'll see. I was kind of hoping to get a two-die block with Noblar, but of course that one was stunned. I can't get a one-die, but might not be worth it. Yeah, a one-die where you have to still roll power stumble is still a bit scary. We'll throw you a bone in that case. Back hope, please level. He's just throwing nobblers at you. <laughs> You've been here since game one. He's a veteran. Watching everyone else level. The poor guy. I'm sure it's a sad really, tale. It's, it's all the sharps just watching the fucking minnows level. <laughs> or the, the bull centaurs. Pretty much. Uh, sadly, not as exciting as I would have liked. And can we get the ball? Oh, let's see where this goes. Yep, not in this case. In the middle of everything. Almost backhoe. Almost. It's the thought that counts. Please level. It's all just, it stuns all the way down for these fucking nobblers. Yep. They're definitely seeing a lot of stars. Good three die. <laughs> Good thing too. Yay, injury! Finally. He's still alive, though. You need to work on that. <laughs> that that's unacceptable. I know. Come
Come on. <laughs> He's holding off a good por a third of your team almost. He is a true champion. Here comes the Blitz. Very nice. Didn't amount to much yet, but you got another block available. Yay, free punches. Or would I rather murder the Minotaur? Hmm, that's tempting too. Oh, not this time. Or is it? There you go. Let's go, Lever. And... Wait a minute. I have Break Sackle. We'll save you here. I don't even need it! <laughs> Yay, the ogre is free. This may be a mistake that cost you. It could be, but... I'm going to move my bull elf over by the ball. Because, <laughs> my god, this man just succeeds on so many dodges without even using the dodging ability he has. Yeesh, you gotta get that team value back. You're squandering it without, without even having to use break tackle. I need a refund. I know, exactly. Yeah, with two guard pieces, I can punch a Minotaur. That sounds like a good time. Bagger 288 versus three of the only important members of your team. Who wins? But I think I've maybe a better idea. All right, fail one of these things. Come on. No. Nope. The block has happened where you want it or not. And because it's a ball carry, we're making an exception. Aw. The block die have been too soft so far. They've been too generous. Mmm. Starting to sandwich the dwarves. It's only a matter of time before the shell breaks. Is it? So many different things that I could do, and like, are any of them actually a good play? Debatable. <laughs> <laughs> and, and so little time at that, because the clock is winding down. But hey, this- like, I could, if I wanted to, do something really fucking stupid. And it's tempting. It worked well before with the red die block. Why not? I'm very slowly making progress with the ball carrier. <laughs> One square at a time. 
Uh, at some point, you'll be on my half of the field. I don't want a GFI. That sounds terrible. Just means you need to punch another Noblar. Aw, oh, no level up for Bacco. Not yet, anyway. Compactor's making a warpath through your team, though. Well, they are Noblar. Are they even part of my team at this point, or just an uh, obstacle for you to trip over? Very nice. The ogre blocks have been treating you well so far. <laughs> so far. And you got block. Just a wee little push. Somehow only one Nobbler taken out of the game so far. <laughs> They've all just been getting stunned. One injury and one knockout, basically. Mm. Oof. What chance is there to save from Blitz? Because then I could push him over for an air block. Uh, sadly not yet. It's never against the guys with dodge. But then again, it's almost never dodging from the guys with tackle, I mean. And he continues to live for now. Ooh, he's one injury away from leveling. Ogre with three levels is terrifying. I know, and I'm not going to get it yet. Everyone hug the ball carrier. Do not let him go. Good God. There you go. Tackles all you need there. Thank God for dwarfs. Still need to work on your punching. Against something with strength one for crying out loud. There, nice power there.
Oh, yikes. All right. Reroll number three. Yay, another injury! Not on back, Odo. Trample the knobbler between your- <laughs> under your feet and then keep r OH SHIT THERE'S A KNOBBLER THERE! <laughs> okay, well at least it landed in like the best spot possible for me, but... There's still- I was really hoping to get a tack- a- like any knockdown but the- the both down, but- So you I'll can move away from it. Injury. <laughs> Okay, just take a nap. And then we'll punch a hobgoblin. They're squishy like Noblar, right? And gain stunned anyway. Yeah, just it just is difficult to do anything other than stun them. Clearly the play is to have a Dundick Inferno Breath run in there, pick up the ball after several dodges, and then pass it to a different ogre. Sounds like a great plan, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. But we'll just settle for marking the ball. Because this is still a 2 plus dodge. Yeah, it's still a 2 plus with dodge. Yeah, just the tackles, the only wild card here. And we do have break tackle. Oh, amazing. I just had a fucking tackle proc on an ogre. <laughs> the dodge! <laughs> got, I gotta get value of my team value, unlike your damn claws on Knobbler. And what? Oh, a break tackle too, I guess. There we go. Alright, and today we bring you the world's worst fucking ball state. Yep, it is nice and surrounded. With plenty of players to be punched. And a knobbler down on the ground who's kind of blocking his extra assists for your claw piece. Alright, yeah, I think the first, like, what we actually need to do to start making progress in here is to just... Progress? We've been punching each other for all the entire half. This sounds ex like exactly what everyone wants. Okay, <laughs> let's and go. I, and I, yep, that'll still be a two-die. Where does the ball go, though? Let's just hope this is not reminiscent of your match with This Pride is just Ops. going, like, this ball is going to end up anywhere. Okay, there we go. Oh, that go for <laughs> it. Going for it. No, okay, I have to try and loner that. No. No! The fucking frenzy going for it. Are you kidding me? <laughs> the big guys truly are the bane of your existence. That and frenzy GFIs, like, they always screw me over. Uh, apparently. Damn. I probably, like, I could have set up a touchdown if he didn't fail that fucking GFI. Now, get down on the ground. Like a good dwarf. Man, that would have set up so many good blocks, too. Grumble, grumble, grumble. I know. My... Granite Gut has not been doing it this much. <laughs> He's just enjoying his new hobby, apparently, just sun tanning in the field. I can't, I can't blame him, though. The weather is really nice right now. Yeah. There's, like, a violence ASMR going on in the background. Yep. Ooh, nice pow, but this is just a guard piece. What we really want is that claw piece. Ah, uh, no armor break. Now...
No, not the three die. Yes, very much the three die. Darn, no bonehead. Yeah, we get to see where the ball goes. Okay, I got the ball. Can I do anything with oh, it? Probably not. Of course, no. <laughs> His own ego got the best of him. Because he was dodging through everything all half long. Alright, is there anyone on my team in touchdown range? No. So you know what the solution is. Just punch everything. Yep. Sadly, no tackle for that one. Hey, go down next to the other guy. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, let's just tie up the claw piece so you don't blitz with them. That seems like a better idea. I don't have a reroll. <laughs> Otherwise, that'd be a much easier decision. I mean, neither of us have rerolls, so it's. We leave it to Nuffle to decide how this goes. Which is never a good situation to be in. Actually, as much as I want to blitz with that guy, there's a better thing I can set up. Oh, we both got blocked, so nothing's happening yet. Unless you want to get another two die block on him. Are you fucking joking me? Poor Come dump on, truck. man. What, what are the block die this fucking match? It's only if it's like a block that shouldn't work that it actually works. Yeah, but otherwise you have been knocking down oh. ogres relatively well. <coughs> you, well, you weren't kidding about the balls he plays, but I don't think that was it. No, I meant to just click on my fucking guy. <laughs> poor, poor, em yeah, poor Iron Guy, poor Ember Chewer. If you were to foul him while he was sunbathing, he'd be really angry right now. Just a stun. A valiant attempt. Oh wait, I didn't want to stand that guy up, I'm dumb. Mmm, punchy punchy. Oh well. Yeah, time for that to be horribly punished and he just dies here. Dead apple dead. Is, who is valuable to punch? Hmm. You've got options. <laughs> A lot of options. No, I don't want to put... Oh, there was a piece there. Okay. Hmm. Oh, yeah, just block these two and I still get a two-die block. Easy enough. Oh, I'm getting a waiting for server. Yeah, I just saw briefly there. It's gone now, at least. There we go. Yeah, it just disappeared for me, too. Oh, it's appearing again. I'm not liking this. Oh, are you there, Blanc Cow? Yeah, I'm here. It keeps on coming on and off. Yeah, it says waiting for opponents, so I worry for what might be happening. Because my stream's not getting affected yet, it seems. Yeah, my stream is fine as well. Yeah, it looks like it's on the server end, because I'm not getting an option to... Oh, there Did... we go. Oh, was... there we go. Tractor getting punched. And it's the final turn, so you can't... Ah. Uh... Hmm. Yeah, let's just pile on. You can't punish this. Damn. I was like, I haven't seen a pile on. That's a very good thing. And there's <laughs> Yeah, it was a very good thing. Two fives and two sixes. Damn. Nuffle one is telling me to do that more, I guess. Oh, 
All right, on to my next bag of tricks. Who of these three dwarves would you... Don't care if they die or not. Let's see, we got the two. We got Bako and Dump Truck close to leveling. They so desperately want a level, so let's just Mer Excavator. Ah, he lives. I tried to give those two a break, but no luck. Oof. And Devil, oh. ooh, Devil ooh. Skull on the clock against piece. Compactor. Two ones though. <laughs> and you get the ball. Just to show that it's still your half. Now, big question. Does the ogre uh, yeah, get back ogre up? Get... No, of course the ogre gets up. Why, why would I ever reduce the amount of players on your damn team? Ugh. Uh, like, whatever. you're still fielding your full fucking team, even though well, I've hit your nobbler so many times. And it's not... Rubble, 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 Stupid ogres. They're a pain in your ass even when you're not played as them. Now I just gotta remember that this, the game decided to put the ogre on the sidelines, so I'm gonna have to drag him out. Now, first door of business, of course, get the damn ogre out. Slacker. He's just hoping he don't notice. Yeah, that's just him rolling bonehead, forgetting that he's supposed to be playing a match. Rolls bonehead during the deployment. <laughs> yeah, what is six chance to decide if you're on the field or not? Oh god, that would really ruin Ogre's day. If just one of them were to fail. Three of your Ogres decide they just don't want to play in a half. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, my last game with uh, Gladiator, he had double fame and basically the pitch invasion knocked all but two of my players down. That was rough. Yeah, and you still have the kick piece, because I didn't knock out or injure anyone. Well, I did injure someone at the very end. Never mind. Yep. The kick piece actually wasn't even on the pitch at the time. Aw. Rompke or someone should have threw a rock at him. This is actually the first time I've remembered to have him out when I'm on defense. Well, that works out then. Yeah, it's going to be funny when he dies. Hmm, I'll... I'll prioritize uh, bash him, because of course he's the most fragile. Ooh, nice Excellent deep kick. kick. And you get the extra love, reroll. Love to see both of those things. Nice pow to start us off. Gotta put the Minotaur there just to remember, just to remind them, like, don't you dare follow up on my dwarves. Uh, <laughs> They're my I was, dwarves. I was, considering still, I was considering still following up because then I could just blitz the Minotaur since you would be so yeah. kind, but... It does require all your players getting knocked down first. At the very least, it denies me three that I... Well, denies me getting a three that I blocked by following up.
Well, well, at least we are alive still. That is something. And we'll just push the Minotaur a little bit further back. Good job, backhoe. <laughs> you didn't die. It's a miracle. And there's a bonehead. We can live with that. Whew. Let me just wipe the sweat from my brow there. They're all alive for the moment. And we got Dang, the ball. Thanks for my guard, guys. I went down. Yep. So now you're down to just one. My fiance is watching Fairly Odd Parents in the background, and that the show is really just something else. I love it. Just an old classic. I don't even know how much of that I watched there. But I remember it from growing up. That and Danny Phantom and all those other ones, similar Cartoon Network shows. All bangers. Will you finally murder a, a Noblar and get that level up? Come on, Come on, level up. Do it, do it. Yep. Yay! <laughs> And best of all, that was a Nobler had SPP. Thank you for <laughs> doing me a got service. You got an MVP at some point, but it's gone now. <laughs> you did me a service because I didn't want him to level up. But congrats on the level up at the very least. Yeah. Do you have it in you for one more, though? For, was it Bacco? Backhoe or Bagger 288 are one injured Nobbler away. Sadly, there's very few Nobbler on the field for you to punch. Well, this, this Minotaur has been doing really good on his wild animals today. Just not the go-forts, apparently. <laughs> nope. Or the armor breaks. Yeah, can we get rid of some uh, Noblar or Hobgoblos? Oh my god, safety vest barely <laughs> does not die. It's a miracle. We don't know how he survived, but he survived. Please, leave that nobbler right there. Nothing terrible is going to happen to him if you leave him next to two mighty blow pieces. You don't say. I'll consider the request.
And away he goes. For how long, no one knows. Whoa. That was an aggressive reroll. We'll see how that works out there. So many different things I could slash want to do, but it's one dies. <laughs> They're ogres. Are you really surprised? No, only disappointed. Oh, well, there are Nobler to punch, at least. So hopefully that'll help you feel better. Yay, I get to punch a hobgoblin again. There you go. You found your target. All right. Now we start wilding, actually. Wilding, huh? There you go, you got the both down. Couldn't even break the armor, damn it. And one more go for it. Oh, jeez, the, the sure feet one into a two. Good thing I have spare Noblar for this occasion. Yep, doesn't want to cooperate as per usual. Hard hat can perish brutally if he needs to. That's what he's here for. But there's a bull, a perfectly good bull center to punch too. Ooh, <laughs> good thing he held on to the reroll. <laughs> Not even gonna chance no. it. Goodbye. At Aww. least that was a red die. He was like, wait, I knock person down on their turn. I knock person down again? <laughs> I get to punch two people at once? This is good day. <laughs> this very good day be ogre. Ogre punch things.
Now, speaking of punching things, let's punch more things. Aw, oh, bonehead. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, that's a good ogre. Take the both down. No! I don't have block. Besides, it went percher dwarf. Exactly. I caught on to your schemes, damn it. I may be dumb, but I'm not going to be You're spoiled. So... <laughs> Too clever for me, damn. <laughs> Ooh, snake guys there. Ooh, and... wow, that... That turn had a lot of things go wrong. Holy shit. Yeah. Oh, this will be interesting. Good, that's not a block piece. He is down on the ground. Still breathing, though. Stupid. Yay, he moved. He's he's so well trained. And double power for your trouble. How are you going to use your ogre dodge now? <laughs> Just dodge normally. It's still a 50-50. And there are but six. The, the lost team value. <laughs> and here comes my double one. There you go, injury. No SPP for you, though. Hey, ogre's out of here. That is what matters. And the nobbler didn't even, or the hob didn't even get ejected. Oh, there's a nobbler on the floor there. That's right. It's just chilling, just sunbathing. Down goes Lieber. Is he going to stay down? For a little bit. For a little bit, Down goes Bako. Maybe he'll uh -oh. never get his level up after all. Whew, yep. Bless Armor 9. <laughs> He's still good. Now, what do we get? Is this going to be a hilarious moment or history in the making? Are you trying to beam Go. forklift? Ask and oh you shall receive. <laughs> Ask and you shall receive. What the fuck? You just missed a nobbler in the ball carrier. Got him. <laughs> what? 
Nice job, Inferno Breath. I was more content to have Noblar surround you so you forced to make multiple dodges and possibly burn your break tackles of assault, but this will do. Icy on the cake would be to stun him. If that broke armor and like did a real injury, I would laugh so hard. It would be fitting. He never saw that one coming. And that's murder stuff. Probably, probably the only way I can come back from this with how close you are to just winning the match right here now. I call that a good day's work right there. You did... You did good, Inferno Breath. You did good. Sad there we go. I, I managed to get the clip. <laughs> Very nice. Everyone needs to see that. Although your your bull centaur pickups have been on point, so I don't expect this to deter you very long. Forklift has some really sticky fingers. Yeah, bulldozer mm. got himself a nice phrasing. Mm-hmm. And the Minotaur is cooperating too. <laughs> the world's most tame Minotaur. Not as team as the friendly Yeti, Ymir. Are you kidding me? That dude wild animal all the time. I couldn't rely on him to do shit. <laughs> but that doesn't sound like a thing a friendly Yeti would do. Ooh, very nice. Now, good chance to just win or at least get the touchdown right here. Yep, still on a roll. That's Forklift, baby. That's why he's the highest SPP player this entire league. <laughs> Just don't lose him now. Things will go badly for you then. Yeah, my greatest fear is that I get, like, dead apo dead on Forklift, because he is uh, very important to the team. All oh, the Nobblers got up! <laughs> Yay, Nobbler power! All right, let's see what we get. Oh, are you kidding me? I was tabbed out messing with the thing, and when I tried to tab back in, it did the kick. Nope, that's why I just tab in or hit Alt Tab again and not click with the mouse. Nope, Fucking that works for you. That God. works for you, though. God damn it, Cyanide! Why are you so terrible? Well, he survives. He survives for now. There's a pow.
All right, now what terrible things are going on here again? Uh oh, uh, I see. Terrible things might happen in a moment. Let's see if we can put an end to that Minotaur's career. Aw, bonehead. Good thing I didn't blitz then. Saved me a little bit of hassle that way. Aw, oh, he lives. That's a shame. Man, it's just a bonanza right in the middle now. Everyone gets to punch everything else. Now, yeah, let's see how these last uh, few turns play out. No, not the Noblar. Poor guys. And just in case you uh, you pull some toss nonsense eh, again. You're going to need more players for that. All right, well, Bagger288 hasn't leveled yet. God dang it. Oh, Aww. I have a lot of rerolls. I don't care. Let's go. There, it worked out. Triple Skull? Nope, but he does live. Not yet. <laughs> He's got to survive the frenzy. He survives the fucking frenzy? Are you kidding me? That was six dice, no pows, no both downs. Now we get to punch a Minotaur. Yep, and I get nothing for it. Are you fucking joking? <laughs> <laughs> it was nice knowing you, beggar. Mm. I, I'll take it. Thank you kindly. This dwarf's a punch, sadly, but I'm okay with a free block. Down goes a dwarf. Eventually, I will hurt break more of your armor. Starting with this minotaur. Aww. Now leave him next to some nobblers, please. He has he wants to level up so badly. Although maybe he doesn't, judging by that last blitz. I had to re-roll it and then didn't. And on six die, I couldn't get two faces on it. Maybe he doesn't want to level up. Maybe he just wants peace. He just wants to live alone to his uh, blood frenzy. Good luck, Floodlight. Yep, it was nice knowing ya. The kick piece is still alive. Damn.
down on the ground he goes. Poor guy. He's still he's still breathing though. All right, Bagger. There's one left next to you. Can you level up? Uh, I was hoping you wouldn't notice him and trip again. Since Noblar are prone to do that when hiding under big guys. Pushes. Granite Gut still lives to punch a bull centaur now. There's your Level. pow. Level. 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 Oh, here Level. It comes. Level. Yes! Level. <laughs> he is a true minotaur. He has spilt blood on this day. Congratulations. You are now among the elite of all the strength fight big guys. Okay, so got to get in here so that none of these dudes can throw. <laughs> that seems like a really silly strategy. And we both pick got both. block. Oh wait, yeah. <laughs> I was saying pick the both down sarcastically and then I was like, wait, he does have block. All right, let's see if you can do it. Let's see if you can I, tie this game up. <laughs> I do have a reroll. I do have the break tackle piece to just dodge on out, if necessary. But first, let's have some fun and punch everything. Because everyone loves to punch things, right? Yeah, we're, we're all rooting for badly hurts here. Especially the expendable hobgoblins. Ooh, hope Hard Hat is wearing his hard hat because he's gonna need it. He is. It'd be horrible, but if he levels up and rolls doubles, I might give him thick skull. Hmm, tempting to punch the bull centaur. But let's go for it there, and then we'll see what I I do later. Are we just gonna sock the bull centaur again? It'd be so funny if it homed right onto him. It all comes down to a 50-50 and a go for it, I think, now. Now, one go for it to bring oh, it no, home. no, no, it no, no. Dun, God dun, dun. It. it happened again. No, why were the throws so good this match? Your bull center has still been on fire, too, so it's a kind of a fair trade. Fair. You know what? Because <laughs> he had to pick up the ball, what, five or six times, five maybe? Five or six and... times, and he never failed, didn't even need a reroll. Fair. So... Completely fair. <laughs> and you got a good amount of Nobler injuries now, at least. It's looking yeah. like a bloody match, at least on my end. Sadly, <laughs> we only see one... What? Yeah. Sadly, we only see one injured dwarf on your side. I want to hurt some hobgoblins. Yeah, the hobgoblins on my team are just very hard to kill for some reason. As are my Noblar, until they decide they are done with life. And they just give up. But yeah, that snake guy's there, that was rough there when I tried to dodge out of yeah, the cage. Yeah, that snake guy's really turned the, the tide of the game. Yeah, that single-handedly ruined everything. But, we managed to make it a tie game at the very least, but we'll see if... Uh, a riot extends this a little bit longer. I 
at the very least, we always have that moment where, what is it, Bulldozer got sucked by a Noblar. Or is it Yeah, that was pretty good. Alright, so safety vest, you are going to attempt to vanity pass to forklift in case you get... Um... MVP? Yeah. At the very least, you got two level ups, one of which is on the Minotaur. This has been a good day. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty happy with a tie game, even if I wish... I've been having so many, like, I got all my early wins, and then it's just been not great from there. <laughs> we'll see if you can but, get yeah, another demo. Incredibly... Get... Yeah, we'll just see if your mentor can get claws and be the most terrifying thing in the league. Oh, yeah. All right, backhoe, can you level also? Nope. No. Nah. Two ones. He's trying, though. You gotta give him that. He's a real trooper. Another injury to Just commemorate this occasion. Put another injury on there. I th wait, this is the guy who got the level. Fuck you. <laughs> or got the touchdown. You haven't used your apple yet. That's fine. I don't care about this friggin' Noblars. Murder him. Indulge me. There you go. Now that's what? Six or seven Noblar injured. <laughs> There's a good game for it, even if it was a tie after bullshit. Can you make the vanity pass, though? Nice and easy. Excellent. And you, and you still have your original 4 reroll shit, dick. Way to rub it in. <laughs> Foul with way, the ball carrier. In the way name to of mass. And it's a devil. <laughs> Badly hurts. Turn 16 foul with the ball carrier. <laughs> well, that is now at least... Yeah, that's seven Noblar injured, one Ogre out. So that was a bloody match for you. Pretty good, yeah. I rolled a six for winnings. Woohoo. And Compactor and one of your Ogres. Good MVPs. Yep, now I need to somehow get him an injury so that way every single one of my Ogres can be level two at least. So I'm going to go with the assumption that you're safe with that match, or f good for foundation. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine with that match. You got a lot of blood for this occasion. I don't think there was any permanent damage. Oh, a niggling one injury on a Noblar. One niggling, but it's a friggin' Noblar. And he had what's coming to him. Had the nerve of that Noblar. Flying across your entire team and getting a touchdown. He, he got what was coming to him, let's be honest. Alright, no no doubles on Bagger, so guard for him. Aww. Gl greatness and glory could still await him, he just needs another level up. But otherwise, and, that was a good uh, match, truck. I'm hoping. Dump truck gets mighty blow. Oh yeah, that was a good match. Like, surprisingly close, all things considered, too. Now go forth and use all that blood-filled rage, all that pa extra power you got to go murder everyone else for me. Yeah, let's see what unfortunate teams I'm fighting in the last three weeks, because, man, they are... This, match, this team is stacked. I'm still waiting to fight Wood Elves, damn it. I want to embarrass Scythe. And that's next week, woohoo! Just hope it's not like my game when you get a fucking brain aneurysm halfway through it. Eh, don't worry. Oh god, Underworld next week. Those poor guys. I'm actually excited for this Wood Elf match. Hmm, it's gonna be glorious. We'll see if the injuries oh follow god. suit. It's it's Underworld, Vamps, and then I think Undead. Yep. Yeah, un Undead might be rough, but Underworld and Vampires are should be a good time for you. Anyways, I will let you be off to enjoy the rest of your day then. Oh, that's a sad Vamp team. <laughs> Poor Roger. Alright, yeah. I'll talk to you later. Good good game. Take it easy. Ooh, it all came down to a little bit of luck getting on the ball in the first half, but that damn snake, guys. I thought having two boneheads rapidly after one another would have kept me safe from the snake, guys. Although, in all honesty, I am wondering if it would have been smart just to go around and be one space further back because really all I want was to be behind my other players but I don't think I could have properly got a cage there 
And that's that snake guys was gonna be waiting for me regardless, which means two of my bone oh, other ogres would have bonehead if I tried to screen or cage. I think I would have still lost regardless, or at least still lost the ball. And it would have been even worse in that context because it would have took Blancao a couple more turns to eventually get said touchdown, maybe. And it wouldn't give me it would not have given me a window to at least tie up the game. So maybe that's a little bit of a blessing that it failed as early as it did, as opposed to having to deal with two more boneheads on that turn, because that's what it would have been if I chose the safe route. But regardless, thank you everyone for watching. I will see you next time.